Oh my god. That's like restaurant quality pizza right there. Hey friends, welcome back to my kitchen. Today we are going to make the viral upside down pizza in a skillet. Let's get started. All right, friends, first things first, go ahead and get that oven preheated to 425. And I'm going to put my skillet in there, it's preheated, to go ahead and start warming up. I've got some lard that I'm going to put on the bottom of my skillet just to keep everything from sticking. All right, let's go ahead and pop it in the oven. All right, now we're going to get started on making our dough. I'm going to just use a packaged dough real quick, so let's go ahead and make it. All I need is this package and some hot water. And we're going to go ahead and give this a mix. And we want it into a bowl. All right. I've got it all mixed in there. And I'm going to cover it with a little bit of oil. And I'm going to stick it on the stove for about 10 to 15 minutes to rest. All right, now let's go ahead and prep our veggies. For us, we are gonna do some bell peppers. I've got green and red, some olives. We've got our marinara, cheese, and pepperoni. Let me go ahead and wash my peppers and get them cut up. All right, friends, our skillet is nice and hot. Let's go ahead and start building our pizza. Start off with some pepperonis. Go in with our bell peppers, some olives. Now for our cheese. Now some of our marinara sauce. Now let's go ahead and put this to the side and get our crust out. Crust, all we're gonna do real quick is just kinda roll it out and then place it on top. All right, now we're just gonna take our crust and lay it over the top. And we're gonna tuck the crust down underneath. All right, now let's go and pop this in the oven for about 15 minutes. All right, friends, the pizza's done, so let's go ahead and pull it out of the oven, and then we're gonna get it flipped over onto our cutting board. All right, so this is gonna be the tricky part. One, two, three. Oh my goodness. Friends. Look at this perfect crust all around. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm gonna give it a few minutes to cool down and then we'll go ahead and cut it up and give it a try. All right, friends, so I let it cool a little bit, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it a cut and we're gonna give it a try. It smells amazing. Look at that. Perfect slice. Mm. Oh my god. That's like restaurant quality pizza right there. Friends, I definitely recommend that you give this a try. It's really super easy and it tastes amazing. Put your own toppings on there, whatever you'd like. But friends, I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share with friends and family. As always, I hope all is well and have a blessed day.